Hey everybody, how you doing? This is about to be a really fun video. I've got some help with me here today and we're going to kick off a new series we're going to call... Wifey Wednesdays. That's right. <laughs> Wifey Wednesdays. We're going to kick it off with a bang with this Beretta Literally. U22, also called the Neos. If you're not familiar with this, first of all, where have you been? These suckers have been around for a long time. Off the top of my head, I want to say they came out in 2002, but when I was in school a long, long time ago, I used to shoot these, and they're a whole lot of fun. But she's going to do some target practice with this. We're going to do some on some paper, then some on some steel, and just see what she thinks about this Beretta, and have a whole lot of fun. You ready to do some shooting? Red Freddy. All righty. <laughs> Hold on, you guys say it again so your face is on the screen. Okay. No, just Ready Freddy. Oh, Ready Freddy. <laughs> Let's do some shooting. Big shout out to Gun Prime. You guys check them out. Check the description down below. First, super quick look at the gun. Pretty much like you'd expect aside from a couple little things. But it has this rail on the top. You know we're going to have some fun with that in some future videos. This lever right here is the slide release. Then you got your safety. The only thing that you might not expect is the mag release is right here on the right side. So right handed trigger finger whoop, drops the mag out these magazines hold 10 rounds as you can see i already have it loaded to the max and not unlike a lot of other 22s they have this little lever here on the side you squeeze the spring down and it just literally lets you drop the bullets in there so that's really cool the sights are similar to glock sights where they have that gold post in the back and then just a black in the front but let's do some shooting and see how we can do here what are your first impressions, thoughts on this Beretta? Picking it up, never seen one before. Um, it looks pretty and it reminds me of a Batman type gun. <laughs> Batman type gun. You know, chicks a lot of times are more worried about the color of the guns and stuff. So she said it looks pretty. I guess it's <laughs> chick approved here, but let's do some shooting on some paper targets and see how you can hit with it. I hit good. Okay, we're about to find out. We might have to have a competition and see who shoots it better. Because I'm a win. I don't know if you want to do that. Okay. My smoke hoodie who. <laughs> okay. All right. First, shoot that right paper target and aim for the bullseye, the center of the body there. And just shoot all 10 rounds and we'll see how you can do with this Beretta. Oh, didn't ra it didn't go in. There you go. You got to bring it all the way back. Now it's ready to fire. Up and left shoulder. Shoulder neck. There you go. And we just found out that that gun has the last round hold up and show them the gun there. There you have it. Last round, hold open. So, looks like you hit a little bit all over the place. <laughs> so, let's reload it and we'll do some shooting on the steel. And it's also worth mentioning all those shots were oh, right at about 10 yards there. So, 10 yards, first time shooting that gun. I think she got most of those shots. All but one of those shots on the guy's body. So, <laughs> we'll count that as good. Can't be a goner. All right, now she's going to be shooting my man-sized steel silhouette and going to aim for all headshots. And now we're at about 12 yards, so a little bit further back, but steel's a little bit more fun to shoot. Let's see how she can do with 10 rounds on the steel target with this Beretta. You going to hit them all? Better. Uh -huh. All right. So now you got to put the mag in and then hit the slide release, push it all the way in there. Up that there you go it has that thumb button on the side yeah i didn't realize that all right now see how you can do on that steel here there you go hold on take your time and aim okay that second one you completely missed them that was a little high there you go. See where you hit him? 
Yeah, I've tried to go a little bit lower than what I'm thinking. Yeah, that's a perfect shot. Where were you aiming for that His one? His neck. Okay. Hit him again. Another one in the teeth. Well, it made me laugh. <laughs> there you go. Ear. All right, ear again. There you go. Now you're getting better at it. Done. Oh, we're empty. What do you think about it now? You got 20 rounds through it. I like it. You like it better than that M&P? Yeah. At this time, she's going to rapid fire as fast as she can into that same first paper target and see what kind of group she gets rapid firing this thing. So, let's see what you can do with it. Right. Yeah, just hit the slide release and then you're ready to go. Gotta get ready. <laughs> fast as you can. Yeah, so hold on. See, that's that's kind of what I thought might happen. She had a better group on that target with the rapid fire. First two shots were right in the bullseye, which makes absolutely no sense, but you guys saw it on camera. She had a better group out of that rapid fire than her first slow ones. Maybe just getting used to the sights. Maybe. But for the last shots, I'm gonna put 10 rounds on a paper target and then at the end we'll see who had the better group bet you can't guess who wins <laughs> all right now i'm going to shoot the same size silhouette target 10 rounds see what kind of group i can get out of it hopefully better but we're about to find out don't miss Rapid fire. No, I'm not doing rapid well, fire. I'm hitting almost the same hole. All right. Let's go down there and compare the two. See what kind of comparison we got. All right, so here's her target on the right, which looks like she only had two off the silhouette, one up there and then one down here, which is not bad for somebody who's never shot that gun before. And then she had one in the bullseye right there, another one close. Pretty and then the exact same spot. My 10 right there. So we're definitely going to get some more practice with, there, with this, and maybe we can even get 10 in the bullseye. That might be stretching it, but... Bullseye one, bullseye one. Maybe that's, we'll call that a tie because we both had one bullseye. Well, I think I win because I got that headshot too. Like almost um, dead center. Okay, we'll say you won <laughs> for a bullseye and headshot. <laughs> I almost forgot to mention, she already has an existing episode shooting the Barrett M99 in 50 BMG. So if you guys haven't seen that video, go check it out. Just put it into Google. Wife shoots 50 BMG, you'll find it. She's actually a really good shot. Thanks everybody for tuning in to this episode of Wifey Wednesday. Wifey Wednesdays. <laughs>